Whoa! Woohoo! Quality! I actually want to see that in person. I don't want to look for the camera. I'm going to have a look. Wow, you can see the bits flying off. That is quality. This is what you can do if you have a machine like this. You can tinker and have fun and have your mate around and just play with all different types of settings. Hello guys, welcome. Ryan here from the London Craftsman. I have a special guest, my mate Sam. Sam Rick, say hello mate. Hello. Right, so we're going to be cracking on and making some bits and pieces we don't know. We're freestyling it today. Sam's come over, he's, he's a bit like me. Well, he's a bit better than me with the creative side. Um, we are going to be tinkering with machines. Today we don't know what we're going to do. Let's just freestyle and see what happens. So we have the Monport. This is a 40 watt fiber laser. So it's just come out of the box. We're tinkering, figuring out how it works. What's the best part about this machine? It's, it's just great for metal. Yeah, metal engraving. Metal engraving. Black aluminium business card. We've just got this thing up and running. How cool is that? Wow, that was quick. Right, come on, my goods, put my hand in. How quick is that? These things are great. We'll, we'll do some useful things in a minute. Don't worry about that. <laughs> we are tinkering and just messing around with light burn at the moment and just seeing the parameters and just getting used to the machine. What do you reckon we should do first, Sam? Start with the chisels. Yeah, start with the chisels. Right, so we're, now, we're having a little tinker, we're having a little test, getting the parameters right. Um, we've got three chisels here. As you can see, they're a bit worse for wear. They're rusty and old and yeah, they need a sharpen too. But we're thinking we could use this laser to bring back chisels. Sam's got it set at 1%. Are you going to hit fire? See what we got? There we go. This is how it works. That's 1% power. Um, don't think it's doing much at the moment, is it? No, not a great deal. Oh, actually, yeah, it is in the camera. You can see it, mate. Yeah, it is. At 1%, that's doing pretty good. Right, well, let's let it run its course, and then what do you reckon? We should bang it up to try it again at what 100%? Yeah. One to 100. <laughs> That's a good question, Sam. So, if it's doing this to the metal, would it actually attack or mark the ply? Do you think, or is it just no? It doesn't. no? Okay, so it's just solely on metal. Yeah. Wow, that's not too bad for one percent, thousand millimeters a second, ten percent speed, one percent power. Right, I think in a moment we're going to crank that up to 100% power, 10,000, yeah, 10,000 millimeters a second. Right, are we going to do it? Let's do it. Whoa! Woohoo! Quality! I actually want to see that in person. I don't want to look for the camera. I'm going to have a look. Well, you can see the bits flying off. That is quality. Do you know what I like about it is that it's not even marking the ply, is it? Mm. Look at that. It's just attacking the metal. Mm -hmm. yeah, let's do that again. Again, again. Can you see the bits flying off? Mm. That's well, well cool. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Have a look at that. What about all these blemishes? Do you reckon they would come out? Yeah, you can go deeper with it. You can yeah. see. You can feel it's a lot smoother there as well. Yeah. It is, yeah. Shall we do a few more passes? See if we can bring them back up to life. Actually, see all the stuff's come off, mate. Yeah, add a bit of paint. Can you see the flaky paint? Wow. So the laser's taking paint off too. Oh, cool. Right. Let's see if we can line that up in the same place as it was last time. Cool. Let's close this up behind glass. But that's to be so. I think we should put the London Craftsman on the chisels, so or at mm -hmm. least one of them. So there we go guys, we could keep going, but you can see the massive difference between there and there, okay, maybe a couple more passes. That one's come up really nice. That one had loads of paint on, the paint's come off. Um, but I think a few more passes, we'd be able to get those blemishes out, where the rust has just been attacking it over the years. But yeah, I think we should clean that face up. Yeah. Should we clean that face up and then we'll engrave it after? Yeah, nice, perfect. Whoa. Yeah, that's it. Sounds like something out of Star Wars as well. Yeah, let's. How many passes are you doing on that? I'll continue it. Yeah, yeah. You can see on the left, it's kind of um, 
different colors actually on the on the, yeah. on the camera yes okay now i'm going to centralize that yeah to where roughly where i want it obviously that's the center point um very rough at the moment yeah i think we'll go with that central ish we've got a logo loaded up sam's gonna bang that on pardon oh another cleaning bus yeah clean my tip as well at the same time and spray tip <laughs> it's all right do it clean so what we are going to do is put that tlc logo on now okay it's had a few bursts focus this there's two dots there if i go up and down you can see the dots splitting apart okay so to focus it you just press the down button or up until you've got them centralized and they both line up and that's how you know it's focused sam's got the file already it's a tlc file okay let's see what we've got wait that was good that was actually quite powerful mate it's kind of like burnt it in a way yeah quality do you know what i'm going to move that i'm going to play around with my chisel i'm going to move it over uh yeah go for that <laughs> just plonk them anywhere one let's 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 do equal amounts one more and then let's do another one because i like symmetry yeah let's go for it this is what you can do if you have a machine like this you can tinker and have fun and have your mate around and just play with all different types of settings so that one has burnt it why do you think it's burnt it we just had the power too high we have got um seaside and we've adjusted it as best as possible so this is um we're going for the actual run now it's in position we've got the black aluminium cards right there are we good to go sam yeah. shall we set the camera up and see how we get along um all right let's go for it go How cool is that? That's all I can say. Um, so there are lots of settings, but you know, overall, a moment ago, that was just a black business card, just like so. And we've turned it into a piece of memorabilia. Is that the right word? Get it tongue tied. Um, anyway, guys, we're going to leave it like that, aren't we, Sam? Thanks very much for coming and um, helping me on this fantastic project. And um, yeah. The fantastic machine the ga30 from monport have a great friday we will see you next friday take it easy ciao for now